right, welcome back to Get Out the House, Go Fish. Well, I'm going out today on a friend's boat and uh, we'll be heading out to the Mayport Jetties here in Jacksonville, Florida. Now, the goal of the day is to see if we can hook into a tarpon. Now, this will be my first time going out trying to hook a tarpon in this location, so I wanted to share this information with you. Initially, we arrived at the Mayport ramp and uh, little did we know there was a kingfish tournament going on and uh, which meant there was absolutely no parking whatsoever. So we had a, a drive an additional 30 minutes away just to launch from another boat ramp. And uh, anyway, we finally got on the water and started heading out to the jetties. Now this is an informative video. So if you're wanting to get out there and try and catch a silver king, then by all means, go for it. Like I said before, this is my first time targeting tarpon here. And after we fish this spot, I'm going to talk about some of the problems that I had but anyway, let's get out there and uh, see what we can hook into. All right, so when we arrived out there, we didn't have any bait at all. So uh, we have the Sabiki rig. Uh, this is the one that we're uh, going to be using uh, to catch our bait. All right, what size weight are you going to put on that Sabiki rig? Uh, 40 ounce or 40 grams, so like one and a half ounce. You don't want it too uh, light because when you get a couple of threads or pilchards or whatever the bait is on, if it's not heavy enough, that's how you actually get the whole sabiki tangled. Common mistake. And when you want to put this away, you just kind of get a good length like that. And just do a couple of rounds. Just to secure the line. Yep, I'm swinging around. Just for now. Okay. If you run, it'll bounce off. Normally, I like to mark them, but for now, we'll just throw. You can't really drive around to mark them. Some that's where I know they kind of are. Yeah. There we go. You got it already? Man, that was quick. Yeah, super quick. With the, the, the thread, thread fin? Constantly keep, keep reeling. Just keep an eye out for the waves. I just make sure we're drifting. Not into anything. Nothing gotcha. Let me get your detector. Get your dehooker, alright. Oh wow, yeah. That was quick. I don't let it sink too much because the rocks are like literally right there. Gotcha. Once you get one on, just kind of slowly reel some more of them come on. There we go. Now I got a stringer. So they see that one on going for that sabiki and then they are like attracted to it. That's pretty quick. Touching the baits. Oh. What's the purpose of not touching them? You take the slime off, then they die quicker. So the rig we're using here, just a sliding sinker, clamp, a swivel, and then a 60-pound leader, and then a six-aught circle hook. All right, what size ounce? Well, I'm using 12 just because of the current, but it just depends on the current that you're fishing. Right. We're going to get our threads in. Herring. Kind of have to scoop more than one at a time. Right through the nose. So you're going across. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm watching it. Uh, Something they might pull it off, might get cut off, and not now. So any thump, it like, has to be watched the entire time. Oh, that's the lace coming. Oh. <laughs> oh, fish, fish. Fish. <laughs> On with a tarpon. All right. First tarpon right here. I don't think I got the jump, but... Oh yeah, he's jumping. Tom? Yeah. Go front. Is he coming towards us or is he off? He's coming towards us. Don't high stick it, don't high stick it. Don't high stick it. Pull it out of his mouth. Nope, that's it. As high as you go. That's it. Pull any higher. Feels like he's pulling. Came off? Might have, yeah, it did. You got a real fast. Okay. I'm just not used to that reel. All right. Zero and one. Oh my gosh. And keep the tip down when you're reeling. Don't, don't high stick it. This is something I'm learning, man. I always keep tension, and then when he jumps, battle the king. All right. Told you we got Whew, man. There's too much action. Get ready for the All right. Rocks. Let's get another one in. Oh, yeah. That's a big shark. Spinner shark. Yeah. Oh. Like crazy. <laughs> oh, fun. Don't fall in. Oh. Woo. Now yeah, a spinner shark. Did you get off. Start jumping in. Something bit that off. Yeah, that's why you have to check the base every so often. Can you uh, control the metal? Yeah. Oh, of course, a freaking tarpon just fed right there. Oh my god, right there in the middle. Oh, uh, broke it off. All right, that's pretty much it. Um, as far as the issues I had, um, there was a l pretty big swells out there, and I got I got pretty sick out there. Even though uh, I did take some uh, medicine to help with that, uh, it still happened. Um, there was a lot of boat traffic. Uh, we didn't know about the uh, the Kingfish tournament, so we did have a lot of uh, boats going by, and then uh, some Navy ships and some cargo ships going by. So um, that. Uh, with the regular swells we also had that and then um, of course at the end uh, of the jetties there uh, even though the action is really great right there um, you know we have to look out for the rocks you know the drifting um, into uh, the rocks you know by the current um, losing rigs uh, constantly um, just multiple things and uh, I'm, I'm 
I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure I'm not going to be trying to uh, catch a tarpon out there again. I, that's just something I wanted to try right there, but uh, it's just too rough. And uh, I think the next time uh, I'm going to look at uh, going in uh, to uh, probably uh, around Nassau uh, or uh, down in St. Augustine. Uh, I think those are the other two areas I'm going to look into, and hopefully I can hook into uh, a nice uh, silver king. So anyway. Anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed it. I hope uh, if you've uh, been interested in uh, going out and uh, catching a tarpon, um, th this is just something that we used. Um, you can also use a mullet. Uh, you know, it will be a lot uh, faster with a cast net and uh, uh, getting uh, those mullet, and uh, that'll work just as good too. So, all right. We went ahead and uh, shot down to the, the Palms uh, Fish Camp. I had lunch. And then uh, we headed on in. So anyway, hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, if you uh, enjoyed the video, please uh, hit that thumbs up. Uh, if you haven't yet, please subscribe. And uh, y'all get out of the house and go fish. All right? Till next time.